morning uh, here in the Forest Glade. We have just climbed up. We're only about midway up this morning. Uh, I wanted to bring the sheep to this glade. There's a lot of food on this side over here that you see behind me. And that's one of their favorite places to go. So they ran right into this area. It is so warm and so chilly all at the same time. There is a beautiful breeze. I just wanted to pop in with one of my little spontaneous vlogs again. Someone wanted to see the sheep, so I've positioned myself to show you them here on the glade. They're behind me. It's been a really good week. It's been busy. I've been keeping myself busy. Heard from my kids a couple of times on FaceTime. My son received his sock package. That was really nice. His first mail and the socks fit perfectly. Emma's doing well. She already has a lot of studying to do. So we're doing really good. We, we're getting used to the day today and a nice tidy house all the time. I finished my sock design. I think it will be out next week. I have a little finished object to show you. This is my shepherd socks. I'm going to be photographing them uh, in the forest, the final detailed photographs. This is a design inspired by my breed of sheep. There's some embellishment on the front to make them grotrendir, which is my breed of sheep. I can just show you up close. Embellish the ear tags and the teardrops on the front and then on the side there's a little uh, heart embellishment in between the I designed this motif to feature this little heart stitch on the side on the back I haven't embellished just to show in case anyone's would rather not embellish that's what they look like they are boot socks for hiking or cozy house socks. They have a heel flap gusset in, a diff in the, in the uh, contrast color. They'd be cute with red also, I think. I'm gonna knit another pair possibly in red. So those are coming out. The test knitters are just testing the final bits of the pattern. And I just have to make sure all that information is included and then they're ready to go. So thank you for your interest in my socks and your encouragement. My force pack socks are also almost finished. I finished uh, the first one last night and I'm casting on the other one to do a bit of checking on the pattern. And those are stripey socks, so. There's those two socks in my collection. Rag socks, we call them, are really important to hiking and our everyday work here on the farm. We all need rag socks. It's, I don't have any other news. I'm teaching my mitten course, which I'm loving. I hope people are loving it and enjoying the prep that we're doing. I've I realized that I needed to do a bit of prep for people before we start. So I've been preparing those lessons and recording those lessons. And I'm really enjoying teaching again, even if remotely. Happy that I can do that teaching and not miss out on my festival courses. It's such a beautiful morning. I'm wondering if now I'm able to sneak away from the flock go home and clean the barn and do all the chores and come back and collect them. I hope you have a good weekend. I might check in at the barn if I do, if I make it. Thank you for your feedback about my spontaneous vlogs. I think it's nice to 
sometimes just pop in and not have to do all that editing and figuring it all out but just uh, say hello to everyone that subscribes and tunes in interested in my work here on the farm so maybe I'll check in at the bar now I have successfully snuck away and I'm making my way down the mountain and to clean the barn so it's working today I don't know how long but anyway have a wonderful weekend and take care until I check in again Thank you.